Good morning, guys. I'm going to take you to the farmer's market, buy some fruit, because um, I'm hungry right now. And I'm going to probably stop by at the bike shop, because I know I'm interested in buying a bike eventually, like a nice, fast bike that can take me around anywhere I want to go, and uh, that will be my transportation. So i got to go to the bank, and then I'm going to come back home and make some delicious some something with fruit so all I care about right now is some fruit let's get ready for it all right let's go donations too for coffee or whatever. Oh, do you? Yeah. Uh, I don't actually have any change on me. Yeah. Is this your, uh, your poem? Yeah, it's my interpretation of Dante. Okay. Hey, thanks, man. I'll take a look at it. All right, good. Have a good day. Yeah. You guys will not get what just happened. All right, so there's a guy. He said, you know, he gives poetry. Okay, awesome. Poetry. I love poetry. Poetry is a form of expression, a huge form of expression. But this guy, you know, his poetry, he writes, he said this is his perception of Dante. It says, O oh Lucifer, O oh Lucifer, pray for my death, but pray for me most now in hell. And three blood-covered witches greet us with the towers of this. They tear their wizened breasts that suckle the undead. In the blistering conflagration and the fetter of burning human meat. Man, this stuff is satanic. How demonic Cerberus kings over the third ineluctable hell. Round he barks with the defeating volume of three-throated hounds. I know this is some creepy shit, man. Salute to him expressing himself, but that stuff is creepy. Anyway, I'm into CIBC right now. Gotta get my bank stuff. I found it. How you doing? Good, how you doing today? No, not too bad. Is that what's going on? Oh, I'm just looking around, you know. I'm not nothing too particular, but um, I'm not I'm not too keen on the bikes yet. But You're not too keen on yeah, the bikes? Like I like I ride. Where are you uh, where are you commuting to? Um well, you know, just locally here around for now, but I'm gonna yeah. Travel Thailand next year, so I'm trying to like see if I can get a bike to bring over there too. To Thailand? Yeah. So if you want to do a little bit of both, and you kind of almost you can go almost a little bit hybrid. Okay. But you can, you know, even in a hybrid, I mean, you can still do like I have, for instance, um, I have a touring bike. Okay. You have to draw fires. Yeah, fires, yeah, right? yeah. So my touring bike, though, um, I run 26 inch wheels on it those are 700s okay. so like my wheels are smaller yeah so it's a little bit not as fast of a roll like the bigger your tire size the faster you roll so. but yeah i'm, I'm yeah. excited to uh because I'm, I'm i'm trying to live as simple as possible nowadays so it's like yeah, for my car like i'm not i'm not uh, planning on driving for too long so i want to get like a, a good bike and you know, what i suggest you do is you know 
start thinking about what you want to budget towards a bicycle. Mm -hmm. So I'm going to do this with my bike. I'm going to do this with my bike, right? Yeah. So my bike wants, because it's my car, it needs to be able to go, you know, I want to be able to go through shoe be park on my bike, right? Yeah. I want to be able to have some recreation with it. I want to be able to go get groceries with it. Yeah. You know, and just start thinking of all those things. Because mm -hmm. that's going to put together the picture of what you need. Picked up some beautiful peaches. I think these are some type of plums. Um, picked up this organic apple juice, uh, freshly made, and it's made locally. Some blueberries right in there, and then uh, some strawberries in there. I also got actually, I actually got corn. Now, if you were to know me, last you know that last time I had corn was probably be like year and a half maybe well not corn but corn on the cob you know I, I, I'm at my work and they have corn there and I was so I can't really talk too much so I'm gonna just get some quick brekkie going here and I'm just gonna eat it up and then head out for work hello sorry I have such a delicious supper that my mom made for me thank you mother mm -hmm. mashed potatoes Corn, cabbage, and I got coconut water. The best. All right, guys. Hope you all enjoyed it. It's a quick little vlog. Hopefully, I don't know. I usually say that, but it never turns out that way. Um, peace, and I'm out.